This video may be a bitter pill for many people. You see, successful people do things differently. If you change the thinking program of the poor to the mental scheme of the rich, you will significantly improve your financial condition. Welcome to Insight Booth, your home of insights that inspire forever. Today, we share 10 things you want to avoid if you're going to get rich. They might sound obvious, but avoiding these pitfalls will set you up for success. They should always be noticed. 1. The rich don't watch TV for more than an hour daily. Money will not come pouring in if you binge watch Netflix shows. Spending more than an hour a day in front of the TV is more than just a waste of time. The average American spends 5 hours a day in front of it, and that's 77 days a year. Imagine what can be achieved with the extra 77 days a year. Yes, it is impossible to be productive constantly. Watching TV to unwind after a long day at work is perfectly acceptable, but spending almost 25% of your time lounging on the couch and watching other people succeed is just about the most useless thing in the world. Have you ever met a successful person who watches TV five hours a day? And yes, watching YouTube on your laptop counts too. But wasting your days like this, moaning that you can't succeed, reevaluate your habits. Two, the rich never let emotions get in the way. You'll often hear people use the saying, it's nothing personal, it's just business. Well, there's a reason for that. As wealth creation expert Thomas Corley says, when you allow your emotions to run high, you are turning off half of your brain. The prefrontal cortex shuts down your emotions, good or bad are allowed to run wild. When you experience defeat or setbacks, this is a horrible thing because you need your entire brain to help you overcome defeat and setbacks. 3. The rich don't blame others for their failures. No successful people will blame everyone around them for their failures. They will only blame themselves. Therefore, if you want to join the 1% of the wealthy and successful, stop complaining about Donald Trump, Congress, parents, bosses, and the whole world. They are not responsible for your troubles rich know that their victories and defeats result from their application or non-application of strength, and therefore they write out the scenario of the outsets, outcomes, and culminations of their fate. They can direct the vector of its movement in the right direction and personally accept congratulations in case of triumph and words of support in case of failure. Rich people don't whine or complain about a difficult childhood, busy parents, a bad boss, and an indifferent government. That's what the poor do. According to Harv Eker, the behavior of such people has three characteristic features. They complain, constantly justify themselves, and blame others. Instead, focus on how and what you can do to become successful, regardless of external circumstances. Many people had even worse lives than you, but they got their way. Take responsibility for your life, and you will have the strength to get what you want. 4. The rich don't feel afraid of money. Life is a risk. Driving is risky. Running is risky. Investing is risky. Switching careers is risky. We take risks all the time. Most of us are okay with the typical troubles related to driving or playing sports, but the game changes when it comes to money. Are there any downsides to wealth? If you ask a poor person, you will think and find at least a few negative traits of wealth. For example, going to jail for it, wasting recklessly, and in general, all the rich are greedy and evil. As a result, on the one hand, people want to be rich, and on the other hand, fear this wealth subconsciously. Therefore, they will never get rich. Those who have earned a lot of money will quickly answer the question about the disadvantages of wealth. Do they exist? Conquer your fear of losing money. Accept that money is a resource that comes and goes. You never really own it. You use it while you're alive. 5. The rich don't care about other people's opinions. You might be jealous of those Instagram famous travel bloggers who seem to follow their intuition, but that attitude won't make you rich. According to best-selling author Brendan Burchard, becoming a high net worth individual is about forming productive habits. Brendan hangs out with society's wealthiest, so he knows what he's talking about. The most successful people on the planet don't care about other people's opinions. Yes, they ask their mentors for advice, but they don't let family, friends, or society determine what they do with their lives or where they find happiness. They follow only their rhythm and make their way in life. As a reward, they receive incomparable and rare experiences, often inaccessible to most. They truly live. 6. The rich don't spend money on consumption. Successful people spend money on things that make them better. Business, personal growth, and what they love. Unlike poor people, rich people never buy things they cannot afford. You'll be surprised, but even the rich always have such problems. So the poor will accept, for example, a costly phone, although there are cheaper phones, and they can't afford an expensive one. The poor will have to take out a loan or spend money that was not intended for this. But the rich, no matter how much he wants an expensive car or a luxurious house, will never buy it if this is something he has to take out a loan or deny himself something else. Successful people spend money wisely. They direct their profits to something that helps them in their creativity. 7. The rich never undervalue their time. Your time is precious. You're undervaluing your time when you waste five hours a day on your smartphone, join every party you're invited to, and burn your days at a job you hate. 
Rich people who started from scratch usually become wealthy because they're excellent time allocators. Only a few are the most innovative or creative people in the world. You don't need to be a genius to become rich. Straight facts. The rich know their time is limited and get the most out of it, working with equally serious people. They don't waste their time, and they do what they say. The main reason behind their fortune is that they constantly think about how they spend their time. They put a high value on it. 8. The rich never overly rely on others. Life is a team game. You've never met a successful or wealthy person who got there alone. But there's a difference between teamwork and waiting for others to help you. You can only build something independently when you always look to others for answers or help. Outside your inner circle, no one will help you succeed. Not the government, bosses, colleagues, coaches, consultants, social media people, etc. That's not because others don't care, but we are wired to help ourselves and our offspring. Respecting this makes us take ownership of our own lives. You, indeed, are the master of your own destiny. 9. The rich don't overeat or eat fast food. You are what you eat, so if you eat food that makes you feel lethargic and slows your digestive system, you'll never have the energy or brain power to come up with million-dollar ideas. That's what famous business coach and investor Tony Robbins believes. He says having the right diet is the key to working in 16-hour days. The quality of the fuel for the body determines success in business and life. Eating clean, healthy food will make you feel good, have a lot of energy, and look younger. If you constantly eat fast food and other rubbish, your brain will not be able to function at total capacity. Without a good working brain and a healthy body, life will never turn out the way you want. Unhealthy eating habits lead to many problems, self-doubt, depression, and chronic disease. All my friends who are successful people take care of their bodies, and they pay special attention to the fuel for their engine. 10. Never neglect reading. You need to keep up with the latest reading to have as good of an understanding of the world. This knowledge sparks ideas and solutions that could equal big bucks for you. Why else do you think the average millionaire reads one nonfiction book per month? Another fascinating statistic, 79% of the rich admit that they read professional literature much more often and everything that is related to their career and can raise their professional level. And although the rich often say they miss fiction, business is their priority. In addition to the fact that the poor generally read much less, only 11% of those who read it all read professional literature. The vast majority of poor people read purely for pleasure. You will say nothing is wrong with this, and I will agree. Only then do you not complain about poverty. Shift your perspective on money so you can change your life. Money is not something you own, it's something you use. Be responsible and protect your money, but only do it a little or it will backfire. Too much money protection turns into fear, robbing you of the magic of compounding. Every person who lives in the free world can become rich. There is a surplus of passive income ideas that we can all apply. But they require time, patience, dedication, and work. If you apply today these learned habits, it might happen much faster. But what do you consider the top thing rich people never do? Let me know in the comment section. Remember to like, share, and subscribe so you can get an upload and enjoy the excellent content we send your way.